Yeah, long stretch of uh, some chilly temperatures are going to be with us. The feels like still sub zero in a few spots out there this morning when you factor in that breeze. So t again, if you don't have to be out uh, today, please don't. Uh, later on this afternoon, we'll only be around upper 20s for highs, by the way. Cold Christmas, warmer than today, but still mid to upper 30s. Uh, going to be a cold one for us. Uh, warmer as we get later in the week and New Year's Eve looks warm, but there's a risk at rain. Not a guarantee, but a few of the long range models all have a system coming our way. The timing still in question. Uh, the recent rain we had on the 22nd, that was nice. That gave us in the surplus category, so we're going to be back to back months now, November and December, uh, with some surpluses. That's been a while since we've been able to say that, so that's some good news there. So as you step outside, again, gorgeous blue skies, just really cold. Have that heavy winter jacket and maybe some gloves, too, uh, if you're going to be out for an extended period of time. Don't expect many clouds. Is today, tonight, clear? Tomorrow, more than likely sunny as well as we go through the entire day. Later Monday will likely catch some clouds. What a long stretch of below average temperatures on the 16th. We were actually normal, uh, but that's it. Now day by day, we're going to be warming up and as we get to Thursday, we should be above average and that trend continues Friday and to the weekend. We'll ring in the new year with temperatures really quite mild. Uh, this is our first stab at a long ways off, but near 60 when the acorn, acorn goes down at seven and for the late night one still in the 50s. A risk of rain, yeah, but very mild. Uh, a lot of times it's quite cold. Not the case this year. 13 degrees right now with a dew point of minus seven. The air is so dry and that breeze makes it feel like zero right now. Nine, the actual temperature in Oxford, 14 in Lewisburg and 17 in Fayetteville. Still some sub zero readings up in our northern tier. So be careful out there early this morning. Very cold. Uh, fair skies around. We're looking good here. Uh, the lake effect snow continues to the north, but quiet travel day today. Our next system that's coming our way won't do much. This is called the clipper. These are typically dry. This will completely dry up over the mountains. We'll get some clouds Monday night and that's it. We're going to keep it dry this week and we're going to keep it relatively cold early on. There's that little trough that comes in on Tuesday. When that moves by day after day, we start seeing this ridge get stronger and we'll see all that warmth coming up here. You're really going to notice it by the end of the week, probably seeing shorts and t-shirts out there by Friday. Meantime, we're in the 20s today. A couple spots could be a uh, close to freezing for a high temperature back to the teens tonight under mostly clear skies. Accurate the seven day then it looks like our Christmas day about 37 degrees, give or take a degree or two. That is going to be a cold Christmas for us, especially starting out at 17 degrees. If the kids want to get out and play with their new toys, they're really going to have to bundle up. First night of Kwanzaa, 41 degrees. And notice we get warmer and warmer each day. And by the time we get to Friday, we're looking at some low 60s. And right now, probably at least 66 or so for a high temperature on Saturday. It's pretty warm, Josh.